Hi folks, it's Evo here from Thunamis Lure Company and welcome to today's episode of Thunamis Fishing Tips. I'm excited because we've got Juliana with us today and we've also got Taj with us and he's on the camera right <laughs> now. And uh, why I'm excited, this is free fishing week here in Ontario. It's a great opportunity to introduce those who haven't gone fishing to the great outdoors, no license required, take a friend, take a family member, get them out on the water, and that's what we're doing today. So, and an easy way to fish for newcomers is troll. So what we're gonna do today, Juliana, we're gonna troll for okay. a smallmouth bass. So we're gonna run some misty minnows. All right. So you get your choice of a color. You got blue, purple, or chartreuse? Blue. Blue it is. Blue. All right, and then Taj, you get one of the others. You got either purple <laughs> or chartreuse. Purple for me. Purple for you, so I'll run the chartreuse. Okay, so. Let's get you started, Juliana. Okay. And all we're gonna do, we're gonna take this misty minnow and just, I want you just to open the bale. Okay. That arm there, and it'll open oh. that up. Okay. Drop, that'll drop the misty minnow down. Oh. Yep. Okay. Now, we're gonna put it in gear and we're gonna do some slow trolling. We're gonna troll at about two and a half miles an hour, nice and slowly and we're gonna work this shoreline. We're in here at about 15 feet of water right now. We're gonna work this shoreline along to the point. That's uh, Point Avenue right there. It's a beautiful lighthouse. And we're gonna work our way right to the lighthouse and in front there and see if we can get into some fish. So stay tuned, folks. So glad you could join me. Keep it tight, keep it tight. Keep it tight, your line. Did he jump off? Keep it tight. Okay, we got our first fish here and that smallie just took a jump and of course I forgot the net. My fault. Okay, so just uh, real slow, Taj, as he's coming closer to the boat. Just take your time. When he pulls, let him pull. Let him pull. Okay, let him pull, let him pull. Okay, just keep your line tight. That's it, tighten your line. Don't let your line go slack. Very important not to let your line go slack or they'll spit the hook. So just keep your line tight and slowly bring them up and we'll get them landed here. Take your time. Okay, it's a nice smallmouth. Hey, okay, hang on, hang on. Now don't reel anymore. You got him up a bit too high. A little bit too high. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna land them for you. Bassmaster style, okay? <laughs> this is what, <laughs> knowing that, we're just gonna lift them in, just like that. There you go, Taj. Woo. Hey, your first smallmouth, there you go. <laughs> okay, let's get him off. Now, I'm gonna show you how to lip lock a, a fish. It's got one treble there just in the side of the mouth and the other one is just kind of touched on the, the side here. Yeah, Taj, <laughs> you're in with your first smallie. Okay, I'm going to teach you the lip lock. Come on over here. So, to hold this fish, I want you to stick your thumb right in the mouth. Stick your thumb in the mouth. He won't bite you, don't worry. Thumb right in the mouth yep. and squeeze your thumb. Yep. Squeeze your thumb. There you go. Lift them up now. And we're gonna take a nice photo for you. How's that? Yeah. We'll snap a photo for you. Now, uh, Juliana, you said you did want to keep some, right? Sure. Okay, so we are gonna keep some. Uh, you promised your father, I know, some fresh fish fry. So yes, we, will, we will keep some bass for you today. All right. And that's a nice eating size right there. there you go. We'll take a photo, Taj. Yep. And then we're gonna get our lines right back in there. That one hit right away. We're uh, fairly close to the to the lighthouse. We haven't been trolling that long, but uh, we got our first fish in the boat. All right, Taj, your first fish in the live well. You wanted the purple. Oh yeah. Hey, eh? and it looks like you picked a good choice. So I'm going to get you back out there just to get us started. Sounds good. All right, here you go. We'll let out a little bit of line, and then we'll get Juliana back out there again, and we're going to continue trolling along this shoreline. And it was funny. Uh, we're trolling along, and then what'd you say, Taj? I was gonna catch some fish, fish today. You said Last you were time. gonna, you said you were gonna catch some fish, and oh, then yeah. we're trolling. He says, "Hey, something's happening here." <laughs> <laughs> Last really... time I wasn't too successful, but today it's it's really nice. There Southern you go. Ontario, um, just off the shore of Crystal Beach, and it's a really nice day today. And I caught fish. That's first it. Few minutes. You gotta love so, that. I'm in a competitive spirit today. I'm catching more fish today, so. You want to catch more Juliana. Okay, so I'm going to get my line back in, and Juliana, we're going to get her back in the water, too. We're going to keep going at it. Okay, we got pandemonium here, folks. Taj struck, and Juliana struck. We both got fish going on here. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Just keep your lines tight, guys. Okay. Let's go see what Juliana's doing back here. Keep your line tight. You still got them? Yeah. 
Okay, keep your line tight. So when he pulls, slow, right? yeah, when he pulls, let him pull. Okay. All right? Yes. Taj, you still on? You're not sure you made a lost yours? I saw a big jump. No, yours is still on, Taj. You're still on. Okay, take your time, Juliana. Always keep your line tight, okay? All right. All right. All right. Keep your line tight. Keep your line tight. He's coming close now. Let yeah. him pull. See how he's pulling? Let him pull. Okay. He's taking drag. That's your drag working. Let him pull when he pulls like okay. that. Perfect. That's it. Let him pull. Let him pull. Nice. Okay, keep him away from the motor so you might want to. That's it. That's it. You got it. What a pro. I'm a pro. I think it's because I caught one last time. Oh, no? let him pull. See, he's taking drag. That's your drag setting. See him pulling? Yeah. You want to come to the other side of the boat and around the motor? Could I go on that way? Yeah, go ahead. Just keep your line tight. Keep Ooh. your line tight. That's it. Keep it tight. No, my rod's in your way, but Taj, are you in yet? Okay, when he comes within about two feet, Taj, just leave him there and I'll, I'll give you a hand to land him. Oh, I see him. I see him. Let him pull, Juliana. Hold on tight. Yeah, okay. Do you think you can lift him in, Taj, you think? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, he's a big one. Oh, you got a huge sheep head. Ah. Okay, I'm going to have oh. to help you land that one. Leave him in the water, okay, Juliana? Okay. That's a big sheep head that hit that lure. Whoa, keep your dial on tight. <laughs> you got a huge sheep head. I'm going to help you land them. I feel like I got a sheep head last time. Okay, Taj, I want you to reel in a little more. This is unbelievable, folks. Okay, <laughs> and now just lift them in the boat, Taj. Lift them right in. Lift, lift, no. lift, 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 lift. You got it. Keep them in the boat. Bring them right in the boat, Taj, and I'll come and get them off, okay? I'm going to get you to man the camera, Taj. And I'm going to yep. get this sheep head, all right? Okay. Well done. Okay, yeah. we got our photo op done. Hey, Juliana. Oh, we got it done. Even though you didn't hold the fish? I had to make him hold it. It was gross. <laughs> it was an ugly fish. <laughs> Freshwater drum. Freshwater. <laughs> okay, goodbye, Mr. Sheephead. That's... Goodbye. There he goes. That's a big sheephead. That was a huge fish. That was ridiculous. And then, Taj, you got another nice, nice little bass there. Got a boy. Yeah, so you're both on the fish, and you know what? That just makes my day because we're out here for you guys, and uh, I want you guys to catch all the fish Your next. and have some fun. So, how about we let this one go? All right. All right. Bye. Oops. Oh, I think he's dead. <laughs> he's a floater. We're gonna have to keep him. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna put it in gear. <laughs> and we'll uh, we'll go get that bass, no problem. <laughs> okay. It figures you start up the boat, and he just took off like a bullet. He was no worse for wear. Sometimes what happens when you bring them up quick, they get a little bit of air in them, and it takes them a little while okay. to, to readjust. So right. what I should have done is held on to them just for another minute, and then let him go. I let him go a little too early, but no worse for wear. Let's get back out on the water. Now we got a good one, don't we, Taj? <laughs> Okay. Getting the tangle here. We got one now, but it's we got a tangle. That's what we got, and it's a good one too. <laughs> All right, I may get us. I'll get us out, and then maybe we'll just keep two lines in the water instead of three. You guys can fish. I'll just navigate. How's that? Okay. All right. Okay. Hold on pull. tight. Let him pull. Yeah, let him pull, but keep your line tight. So, okay. Frank, when he doesn't pull, you pull okay. and reel. What we did, folks, we had a bit of a tangled mess there, and actually, the braided line was so bad on Juliana's rod. I've retired that rod. I gave her mine. Just put the line in. Taj is not even out yet. And uh, put it in the gear and she struck. Struck gold. <laughs> it struck gold. Taj, we're two for two. Oh, 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 oh there, there you go. See the jump? Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, let him here. pull. See where he's pulling? Just let him pull. Let him do his thing. Now you can pull back and reel and reel. Crank, crank, crank. That's it. Crank, crank, crank. See how he's loosening up? Yeah. So when he comes towards you, you got to reel faster okay. so your line doesn't get too loose. Okay, there he is there. Ooh. Whoa! <laughs> I love the way you... <laughs> okay. Right. Let's just lift him right in, Juliana. All Here, right. I'll lift him in for you, okay? Yeah. Okay. There you go. Woo. Well, how long did that take? Not long at all. <laughs> Okay, now we got treble hooks there, so you got to be very careful. Very good, just like All that. Right. That one treble just in the side of the mouth. There you go, Juliana. Hey. Would you like another photo? 
Um, with the bass. Sure. Okay. I would. We're gonna do a quick photo op, and then I think we get these lines right back in the water again, and we'll get Taj. We'll get you back in there too. <laughs> there you go, Taj. Okay. <laughs> Looks like you got a decent one. I got to tell you what happened. We had another tangled mess. We retired a second rod. I've got some work to do when I get home untangling those uh, braided line. So I gave her, I gave Taj my other rod. He's got the bait caster going here right now. And uh, looks like the bait caster's brought you some luck. Same lure, different rod. Just keep your line tight. Same procedure. Keep your keep keep cranking. Don't let your line get loose. That's it. Keep cranking. Keep cranking. When he pulls, let him pull, but don't let your line loose. That's the key. He's going to jump. He's going to jump. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. Crank. <laughs> Keep it tight. <laughs> yeah, when they jump, right, they jump, they try to shake the hook. So as they're jumping, just keep your line snug. Now, if you put your rod tip up just a little bit, and again, don't reel the line in all the way to the top. Leave about two feet, and then I'll, uh, I'll land them for you. So just keep slowly bringing them in. Keep your line tight. It's a decent bass. Keep tight. No, 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 no. Real, real, real. Yeah, don't see how you let your line go loose. Don't let it go loose. Keep it tight. That's it. That's it, Taj. Okay, keep reeling. Real, real, real. Real. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. Okay, now hold on. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. Bring him, bring him up here to me. Uh, okay, I'm going to land him for you, Taj. There you go. There you go. Well, Taj, here you go. There's your your third fish right there. You got him on the bait caster. Here, you want to hold him? No, I'm okay. You're okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? That's the tiebreaker. Juliana just missed one moments ago, and Taj, you got the tiebreaker. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's my good day. It's your good day. You know what? It's a great day. If you get an opportunity, I'm going to put this one in a live well because I know Juliana. We're gonna bring that one home for you too. But here's the thing with free fishing week, no license required. It's a great opportunity to take someone out fishing. So whether they're young, little youngsters, take them out, get them to enjoy the great outdoors, start them off young. If they're older like me and retired, what a great hobby to have and spend your time during retirement. And of course, if you're working age and you're working all day, what better stress relief than to get out there on the water? Doesn't matter, boatless angler, you're on a boat. If you have a friend or a family member, take advantage of free fishing week, no license required, no matter where you are, which state, which province, and introduce someone to this great sport of fishing. We're having a great time out here. Congrats on the tiebreaker. We're gonna keep crawling <laughs> up. Yeah, we're, we're gonna keep trolling a bit here because we're having so much fun. Good day on the water. Oh yeah. Good day on the water. You took the sweater off. You're warming up now. Yeah. <laughs> you, you mean business. Of course, of course. All right. And Juliana, good times? Good times. Good times. All right. Well, with that, folks, I want to say thank you ever so much for tuning in to today's episode of Thunderous Fishing Tips. And as always, until next time, good luck and good fishing. Well done. <laughs> hey.